going on YouTube, grand opening of a beautiful, beautiful thing that's happening in Arizona, in the Aerosoft community. I just cast right now, I shouldn't have. Sector 9 Aerosoft. I did not even see her. Ninja, son. Ninja. Is she sitting behind you? Yeah. In the back. Yo, Lewis! Sweet ass Randall's a bit. <laughs> good, good. Well, bro. Oh, yeah. You know, fight like the store on opening day, right? Well, we put it right on here, man. You get a whole bunch of the Damn, this is sexy. <laughs> I think Luis is in the back. All right. Yeah, I think he's back here. Oh! I'm buying something today. Baby, you got me buy something today. What do you want to buy? That XCR. You better find Chris for it. So there's three up on the S. Huh? Three. Yeah. Oh, What's up, Hayward? What's up, brother? Nine up there. Good. Is it an epic job? It's nice, man. Yeah, we're here till one in the morning yesterday for today. And we got the stuff there. Fuck, man. Sorry, I wasn't here, dude. All right. We didn't get a chance to clean the cover. <laughs> So much shit on here. It's nice though, bro. Yeah, we really like blind plug here. We should be like skinny skinny. Oh yeah. Oh. Sure. Sure, you can do it. We got old man from uh, over here chilling at Sector 9. What are your thoughts on uh, this beautiful shop in the airsoft community? Makes me hard, you say? It's going to be awesome. That's all I got. That's all you need. You're good to go. Nice, nice. What kind of products are you guys selling? Well, our main concern right now is going to be getting the much needed parts to our airsoft community that nobody really seems to carry local. And then from there, a few guns, and uh, pretty much relying on the feedback of our customers to see what they want us to uh, carry. So, hopefully, just a little bit of everything. Nice. Kind of like Santa's asshole. A little bit of everything. <laughs> so, where no reindeer has gone before. <laughs> so, explain to me the the process of um, you guys went through to um, to build this place and whatnot. Um, it, uh, yeah, it sucked a lot of uh, fantastic ass. Um, it started with tearing the ceiling out, uh, all the drywall damage. It was uh, definitely times of uh, never thinking it was going to be done. Other than that, it was a labor of love. Yeah. I think that's enough for now. <laughs> Dad. So right here we got another local airsofter. You guys seen his fuck YouTube videos. So, Name's Bowser. The yeah. man with the meat. The man with the meat. Yeah, I was beating two children with my meat at Vanguard on September 22nd. Vanguard didn't like my uh, meat picture, so uh, they asked me to take it down. Or at least not untag him from it. I thought it was hilarious. 
What's uh? What, I, I don't get what the problem was. All the kids love me beating them with their with my meat. So uh, whatever. That's their problem. They don't like overage men beating underage children with meat. Sausage. I don't even like sausage. I threw it away afterward. <laughs> it was starting to get a little uh, limp and not so uh, firm. So I mean, you want to beat someone with a solid object, not just some like flippy little. <laughs> what are your uh, what are your thoughts about uh, Sector Nine, Bowser? I'm excited to see a new airsoft store. Uh, it's kind of sad about the situation with Gearbox closing down. God bless Ron and his family. But, uh, but yeah, hey, we we move on. We got a new store coming up. Hi, what's up? You, what's up? You look so angry at me. Well, I'm paying attention to what you're saying. I think it's kind of funny how no one looks at the camera. They angry. always look... I'm always angry. Yo, what's up, guys? So, you guys just watched the Sector 9 um, store review I just did. Not really a review, but uh, I'll let you guys know what I think about it right now. I like it. It's small, but I mean... The environment's pretty friendly. It's run by airsofters, so it seems like a legit place. Uh, I know the owner personally, pretty cool guy, and he's he's trying to get everything that we need as airsofters. So go and go down there, make a request, what you need, and then uh, I guarantee you he'll probably get it for you. Um, one of the coolest things about that um, Sector 9 is they have the cheapest BBs in Arizona. So... Cheapest BBs. I don't know what else to tell you. Also, I bought a gun. I didn't get the XDR like I wanted to. But I did get this glorified shotgun. I don't know who made it. If I can find the box. UK Arms. That's who made it. UK Arms. It came with this. Came with the gun. Spring, um, single shot. I use this at uh, Tempe Paintball, and this bad boy is sexy. It's uh, it's roughly around, I want to say 298, 300, 301 FPS. It shoots nice. Uh, I shot um, I shot old man straight in the booty cheeks, point blank, and uh, I'm pretty sure I left the mark. So it came with this. It came with this shotgun holster. I can put my shells in. Fucking put it in there, one hand in. You guys get the point. It came with four shells. Pretty legit. And then, this is the best part. This is the best part. It came with this gnarly scope, or a red dot, plastic, and then this, this wicked flashlight. Plastic as well. I haven't put it on there yet, but we'll see what happens. Uh, stay tuned for more stuff coming from um, from Lights Out Airsoft. I've been out of the game for a while. I apologize. Been busy with school and whatnot. But yeah, keep it gangster. Remember, always wipe up, never down.